What's going on everybody? Bam Bam Johnny, Real Tree Lodge. Today we're going to check out the supply drop from InkGaming.com. I think I got this. Oh my god, I got this. I think I got this. Can I get this? <laughs> yeah! Oh nice, Gus has a nice old style cap. I'm sorry Gus. I apologize to Gus's kids. This is a monthly subscription service. You pick either the Essentials here for 30 a month, uh, we have the Elite for 60 and Epic Box for $100. Uh, you pick your favorite color. There will be things associated with that color in each of the boxes. In this video, we did three months' worth of the Essentials. Uh, we actually had to wait three months because they would not send any of them earlier to make this video come out a little quicker. Maybe they'll do it with the Elite Boxes. <laughs> or we'll just wait three more months. And then three more after that for the Epics. But let's check it out. There's not much of a description here. They give you some examples of uh, what a Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, Elite Box would look like. Uh, here's some Magic Essentials, which we're going to be opening three. What this potentially could look like. Contents may vary. And uh, this is another one. It's uh, for Yu-Gi-Oh! It's Epic. Uh, yep. Let's just get right into it with box number. What is going on, everybody? Bam, bam, Johnny. I can't find. Oh, there it is. The real tree lodge. Son of a biscuit. There it is. The real. It's upside down. The real tree lodge. Today we got some fun stuff here uh, from Ink Gaming. They do some fun things. It looks like. Um, they have like a monthly subscription. There's three of them. I'll probably explain this in the beginning of the video. I don't know why I do this. They're trying to open up different products like this. Um, <clears throat> yeah, this is the, the cheaper one. It is called <laughs> The Essentials, I believe. The Essentials. Thirty bucks a month. I need to buy some sleeves though. I'm trying to get all my commander decks together with the right sleeves. Nice little tracks of sleeves there. All right. Let's see what we're getting with this. We got a play mat. I do like play mat? All right. This thirty. Yeah, this is thirty. Cool. Nice. I'll take it. Feels good, like a good play mat. We got a ton of play mats, so I, I will take another one any day of the week. This actually came with a uh, little starter kit. Let's see if the arena codes in there. We might give these away in this video. I have a uh, a good amount of these still too. I end up buying things for cheap often. Uh, what else comes in here? Blue paper. I'll probably upgrade to the middle tier one and then we'll finish up with uh oh with the the elite boom all right mission accomplished so the essentials boom all right and we got some dragon dragon shield sleeves that is actually going to be it for this one. I wonder what else you can get with these. Uh, there you have it. What is going on, everybody? Bam Bam Johnny, Real Tree Lodge. We are uh, doing our second, a uh, yeah, our our second month's. Um, what's this called? Oh yeah, there you go. Ink Gaming. Uh, this is the Supply Drop Essentials. I was trying to get them to see if they could just send me three example uh, packages back to back. Uh, so we just kind of review the product a little quicker. I'm going to do three of these. This should be the, so this is the second one. Then we'll just kind of compare and contrast. You know, or, you know we'll, we'll give it a little opinion of it. Uh, the first one was kind of quick. Uh, I kind of just stopped abruptly <laughs> right afterwards. I don't know what I was expecting, but... We'll, we'll do an overall review. All right, so uh, I forgot what we paid for this, but uh, yes, we got a playmat tube. It's not bad. Uh, what's the company on this one? 
Monster, scary good. All right, that's cool. We'll take a play mat too. Uh, oh, on play mat. All right. Oh, we got here. Looks like. Uh, <laughs> looks like I don't know what this is. <laughs> it looks cool though. Uh, a little more going on than the last play mat. Um, yeah, I'll find that. Feels good. Uh, I said, don't know if it's just uh, from a game or anything. I'll find that out, I guess. Uh, but looks looks pretty sharp. And what do we get this time? All right. Let's see here. I think what's boning me out so far. Oh, I was gonna say is not being able to open packs. <laughs> the last one came with like the oh, what's this here? It came with like a uh, a starter kit. What is this? Okay. Oh, okay. So this is a uh, Red Thorns. So this is just a. Uh, let's see if we can read that here. Fantasy Illustrator Clint Clary's work is best known for his painting of bold colors. Uh, you might recognize his art from Magic: The Gathering or Dungeons and Dragons, from Dark Angels and Squirrels Riding Toads to Fantasy Warriors and Forgotten Sanctuaries. Uh, Clint Clary's work takes any game to the next level. All right. Um. Cool, these are all just different, uh, or three different artworks. Uh, I'll have to check out where these are from because I don't remember ever seeing Red Thorn or something like that. But cool, this time we actually oh, we've got another sticker. Don't know where I put the first sticker, but uh, all right, yeah, uh, you know, I, I like opening packs and they're set boosters or March of Machines, so that's nice. Let's uh, let's see what we get here. Well, the Japanese packs, but I'm going to open them. <laughs> I think the Japanese packs, yeah. I'm going to open them like normal packs. All right. Well, this is pretty neat. I'm doing that backwards because I'm a big old idiot sometimes. All right. We've got Golden Scale Aeronaut. We're hanging out at Gobocon. Agar. Freezing Flame. Whoo, Ruta. This card has caused me so much trouble when it first came out. All right. Well, cool. Stormclaw um, Rager. We have a completed Huntmaster. And some more commons. All right, cool. Yeah, last week came with an Arena Starter Kit, which wasn't bad. I mean, yeah. I just wanted some packs to open, I guess. which would kind of bum me out. <laughs> but it's fine. Uh, we'll go through it all after we get one more box. I really wish they would just send me what the third one would look like. All right, we got a little shiny boy there, and Yargle, Yargle, and uh, Multaney. We got Tetsuko Umazawa Fugitive. Wow, I pronounced that right, I think. Uh, Indiscrepancy Mascot. No, wait, Interdisciplinary Mascot. Woohoo, I'm reading good today. And they need the early morning openings more often. It's like 8 or 9 o'clock, it's not super early. But usually we open up everything in the evening with the exception uh, single packs for shorts and TikTok. Well, there we go. I don't know if I need to do the whole Bam Bam Johnny thing. Hello, on, everybody. Bam Bam Johnny. I don't know why I keep on doing a little intro for this, but uh, we're going to do our third box from Ink Gaming. Do a little monthly subscription. It's the Essential Supply Drop. Let's see. Oh, God. I can't even open this box. Right here. I hear something that sounds like dice in here. So far, it's been pretty fun. Uh, we'll, we'll do this little review here on it. I think it'll be good. Um, I think if I can open this box, it'll be better. And then we'll try the next tier, I guess, and see how that ends up going. Let's see here. What are we getting first? We have a, uh, looks like a box. A deck holder. <laughs> A deck box. It says thank you right on top here uh, for your purchase and supporting. I guess this is an all natural box. A box in a box. It's a box inception. All right, so what we got here? We got Boulder. Boulder deck boxes can hold a hundred sleeved cards. Oh, that's uh, all right. Not too bad. I'm guessing it's made out of recycled plastic. I'm assuming. Uh, more than likely. Uh, oh, oh, dropping stuff. 
Let's see, uh, nice little official glow in the dark ink gaming uh, pin. All right, uh, we got one uh, draft booster from uh, Frexit. All will be one. We got a nice set of die here, which works out pretty good. I'll just add that to my massive collection of dice that I use for D&D. Of course, a little stickers from them. Uh, Viking with a cute uh, mom tattoo on there. Of course, we'll talk about that. There you go. I'm sure you saw these. And we got this random box here. Uh, deck battles are ready to play 60 card decks built around a theme or archetype. Uh, power over death comes a terrible price, one that must be paid in blood. Blood is black control deck that plays tons of creature removal and kills everything that hits the battlefield. Black death. Let's just check this out, I guess, here. Oh my god, the power of scotch tape holding it together. This is pretty cool. I mean, uh, we'll see here. We'll see here. Ugh. All right, another sticker. So we got a small, small supply of stickers here. Let's see here. Run through this real quick. No big deal. Ready to play 60 card deck. Uh -huh. My Grim Physician. Got some Nightshade Assassins. Alright. Um, uh, the Charger there. Sulking Killer. We got Deadly uh, Derision. Oh, we got some Ministrod here. Uh, Dead Weight. All right, ambitions cost and uh, and so blah, 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 blah. disfigure splatter goblin, a Phyrexian goblin. Okay, masked black guard. Uh, so I mean, just a fun little deck, no super duper value here. I don't believe could be wrong. Was there any rares in this? Just like a got some uncommons. I don't think there's any rares in here. If there were, I missed it. No big deal. That's pretty neat, though. Uh, all right, let's just crack this last pack here, and we'll do all this editing and figure out how we feel about what we got in the last three months. Now it's going to be a Japanese pack. Oh, still love this land. All right, we have Keth, Crucible, Goliath. Uh... Unctus? Uh, I can't even really read. Uh, Stay in school kids. Apostle of Invasion. Awaken the Sleeper. And there you have it. Bam Bam Johnny, Real Tree Lodge. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if you, hit it. If you haven't already. Hit the thumbs up button and all that good jazz. If you subscribe to this uh, description service, let me know what you think about it. Is this fair? What do I look forward to when I go up next tier? There's two more tiers to go up to, so it's going to be a long, drawn-out process because they won't send me multiple multiple boxes at once. We're not cool enough. That's fine. Later. Bam Bam Johnny. Did it all backwards. All right, there you have it. Three months' worth of essentials from uh, InkGaming.com for 30 bucks a month. I think I'd recommend it. Uh, it's a good gift for anybody that likes magic and you're not sure what to get somebody that does like magic or different TCG uh, games. The only thing I'd probably switch is maybe give an option to list how long you've been playing magic. I think the starter deck for Arena, uh, for me, didn't really do it. Uh, I think I'd rather have some packs instead or something else. But like I said, overall, I enjoyed the product. Uh, let us know in the comments if, if you tried this out or if um, you tried other services like it. Maybe we'll check it out. Hopefully we'll get the Elite video out a little quicker. Maybe we can convince them to send us the boxes earlier just so we can kind of see what we're looking at. If not, we'll be back probably September, uh, maybe October with the next video with three Elite boxes. Um, Bam Bam Johnny, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We really would appreciate it. You can also check us out on TikTok and Facebook and all that good jazz. Uh, so we'll catch you later. Oh, I just want to do finger guns. Every time I do a video, I just want to do finger guns.